Good morning everyone. My seminar topic is on wireless power transmission technology. Overview of this seminar is introduction to wireless power transmission, why not wires, history of wireless power transmission, need of wireless power transmission, types and techniques to transfer energy wirelessly, advantages and disadvantages, application, conclusion. Introduction to wireless power transmission. As a word, wireless means without wires. The transmission of energy from one point to another through vacuum or an atmosphere without use of wires. Wireless transmission is useful in cases where interconnecting wires are inconvenient, as others are impossible. Why not wires? As per studies, most electrical energy transfers to wires. Most of the energy losses during transmission. On our average, it is 30%. In India, it exists to 40%. History of wireless power transmission. In 1897, Nikola Tesla had a vision of world wireless system. So that 187 feet, feet tall tower was built to broadcast energy. So that all people can have access to the top free energy. It managed to light 200 lamps from a distance of 40 kilometers. Due to shortage of fan, tower did not get operated. Need of wireless power transmission is reliable, efficient, fast, low maintenance cost, it can be used, can be used for short range and long range. Types and technologies of wireless power transmission, near field techniques and far field techniques. In near field techniques, there are three types so inductive coupling, resonant inductive coupling, air ionization. In far field techniques, microwave power transmission, laser power transmission. Near field technique, near field communication is a short range wireless connectivity technology that uses uh, magnetic field induction to enable communication between two devices uh, in order to communicate when they are brought near to each other. Inductive coupling. In inductive coupling, there are two coils, primary and secondary, which are not connected by wires. Uh, energy transfer is due to mutual induction. Example, transformer, electric brushes and wireless charging pad. Uh, in a wireless charging pad is the primary and the uh, device is a secondary which are need to be kept near, near to each other. It is preferred because it is comfortable. It is shock through less use of wires. Uh, this is a uh, resonant inductive coupling. I made a mistake here. Please change it. Combination of inductive coupling and resonance. Resonance made two objects to interact very strongly. Inductor induces current. Air ionization, tougher touch technique under near field energy transfer technique and air ionization, air ionization from only when there is an eye field, example lightning, not feasible for practical implementation. Advantages of near field technique, no wires, no e-waste, need for batteries eliminated, efficient energy transfer using RIC, maintenance cost is less. Disadvantages, distance constraint, field strength have to be under safety levels, initial cost is high, in RIC tuning is difficult, high frequent signal must be the supply, air ionization technique is not feasible. Power field transfer, it aims at high power transfer, it aims at high power transfer, it can be a laser of microwave transmission, it needs line of sight, uh, it is radiative in nature. Microwave power transmission. Transfer of high power from one place to another. Two places being in a right of, line of sight usually. A complete MPT system consists of three essential parts. Electric power to microwave power conversion. Absorption antenna that captures the wave. Reconversion to electric power. AC cannot be directly converted into microwave energy. AC is converted to DC first. Uh, transmitted wave or received at rectina which rectifies gives DC as the output. DC is converted back to AC. Laser power microtransmission. Uh, laser power transmission. Laser is highly directional, coherent, not dispersed for very long, but get transmitted when propagates the atmosphere. Simple receiver, photovoltaics, cost efficient. Advantages of power field technique is easy, efficient, need for grid substations are eliminated, low maintenance cost, more effective when the transmission and receiving are in line of sight, can reach the places which are remote. Disadvantages of power field technique, radiative, need line of sight, initial cost is high, conversion is inefficient, absorption loss is high. 
applications of wireless power transmission is used in uh, IoT sensors and air quality monitor and motion detectors and radio frequency identification RFID and uh, solar power satellites, consumer electronics and uh, electric vehicles, fuel free airplanes and uh, industrial purposes. Conclusion. In future, transmission will be without wires, then it will be more efficient, better than conventional wire transfer, low power loss, energy crisis can be decreased, the near future world will be completely wireless. Thank you.